Ah. The legislator. Uh, I might as well do a rent. There's something bugging me. Nice building at night. You know, the legislator, freedom of speech. Everybody has a voice. Yeah. Only if you're a nerving employee. Okay, let's see what we could do here. Uh, put it right here. Oh. Ooh. Okay, Charles will blow here. <sighs> Nothing better than starting your. Uh, let me check to see if it's going. Yeah. And nothing better than starting a, a rat blowing blowing your nose. Oh, by the way, it's my first rat with my new hat, helmet, bicycle helmet, comfortable. I even for, I was walking today and then I was half half a block and I forgot that I had it on. So Michael Fox from the Ferdinand Police Force, merci beaucoup. I'm wearing that. Okay, now what's bugging me today? I'm very concerned that a few days ago, I know, I'm jumping ahead, I got a call. Uh, we found out <clears throat> a couple of hours ago, my source, that our famous or infamous Sergeant at Arm, Monsieur Dan Bissier, will not be charged by the Fredericton Police Force. I got a call, my God, what's his name again? That guy from Boys Town? Not important, I forgot. Anyway, Mr. Bichette escorted somebody out. I guess the guy wanted to ask question to Brian Gallant, and uh, you know, he's supposed to be part of the media scrum. And uh, Mr. Bichette escorted him out. I arrived here afterward. I didn't know what was going on. And uh, I guess this guy, what's his name again? Anyway, he runs an ice factory. Uh, he, um, he pressed charge, and I guess tonight it was announced, or today, <coughs> that Monsieur Bichard won't be charged. Now, there's one thing bugging me, a few things bugging me, but this issue here, I did a rant last week. I came in, remember, just check, check my blog. I opened the door, of course this is locked, I opened the door, just for a joke, and there was a commissioner standing right there. Right there, right at the door. And then, a couple of days ago, I was in the corner, just in the corner, just, you know, sitting on my bike, and somebody sent a young commissioner to come and tell me to move two feet. Two feet. Now, somebody, something's bugging me. Because Monsieur Bissier, after a huge, huge battle with the blogger, hey, he wants to play with the big boys, no problem. Uh, after about three nervous breakdowns, and you know, the power calling the police, and the police came after me, and Monsieur Bissier, you see him, you know, walk around, and but he decided last year to wave the white flag, and it's over. He never apologized to me, but it was over. So I haven't blogged about him, but I'm still banned from that place. Who wants to, who wants to go in there anyways? More fun outside. But he hasn't bothered me at all. But I find it curious. All of a sudden, I come around. There's a person behind that door, and then I was told to move three feet. So to media or the people that's on their ass, tweeting, Facebook, and you know, on the phone, and uh, emails. Hey, do me a favor. Where's Dan Bichier? I How come he didn't come after me? I usually I see Mr. Bichier walking around, just two streets in Fredericton, Queen and King. I see Mr. Bichier once maybe a week, walking straight, and walking up, and walking down. I haven't seen him. Is he going to get back where he belongs? But I mean, no, sorry, no hard feeling, but uh, I haven't seen him. So, 
Uh, do we got a new Sergeant at Arm here or what? Uh, do we have a bunch of Quebec? I'm sorry, I apologize. Do we have a bunch of Moody Quebecois in there? Media. I, I'm just curious. Where's Dan Bichier? <laughs>